Spain Sari Artist of the Year consists of two different exhibitions, uh, the group show here every autumn and then the exhibition by the winning artist of the Sari Artist of the Year from that group exhibition. The Surrey Artist of the Year competition is a lovely way to interact with the public and the public can reward us and get involved by voting for their favourite artist. The Surrey Artist Open Studios provides a fantastic environment where artists and makers can get direct feedback on their work, they can try new things and visitors can see such a variety of work, how it's all made to the final product and this is such a vital insight into how much work goes into a piece and why it's worth investing in these unique pieces of artwork. We have over 250 artists, so this award offers one of those artists a great opportunity and great stepping stone to their professional development. These are two paintings that I did last year for the, um, the Peru show at the New Ashgate Gallery, both based on the idea of textiles and tapestries, which I saw a lot of when I was in Peru. The Peru show gave me the opportunity to try some new things and it kind of focused my ideas. And then since doing that show, I've been able just to bring back the imagery, but now I feel that the patterns are more complex. They seem just to have a lot more depth. So it's been really good from that perspective. When I had the exhibition, I had somebody from the South Hill Art Centre. Um, she came along to the show and invited me to, to do an exhibition. Last year I did a show at the Medici Gallery in Cork Street, one of the, 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 the most famous roads in, in London to, to show, show your paintings. Next for me is the Korean International Art Fair in Seoul, South Korea, aiming to take about 20, 30 paintings out there. The Sari Artist of the Year offers a range of opportunities for the artists. Uh, that includes, of course, the obvious exhibition, but also a chance to work with a curator, to work with a professional gallery. That means that they will get, receive uh, marketing, access to our mailing list, access to new audiences, uh, perhaps just a chance to work with a technician or a gallery staff, thinking about the ways to display their work, thinking about audiences really. So it's a range of uh, different opportunities. And in addition to that, uh, sometimes it includes a level of mentoring and an award uh, for the winning artist. <laughs> These uh, paintings are a result of the award I got from the Surrey Artist uh, of the Year, where they presented a thousand pounds, which I had to use uh, to further my career. And I've always wanted to paint up in the Western Highlands of Scotland. Uh, so we decided to take that wonderful train journey from Glasgow to Malaig, um, which was incredible because it was a rainy, misty, journey and the light and the mist rolling down the, the hills was fantastic. Although the weather was fairly inclement, I did actually manage to do four small oil paintings on, a, on my lap in the car, looking through the windscreen with the wipers washing the rain away. But from that it meant that when I got back to the studio I could take all the colours from the small oil paintings I've done and from that I think I've achieved something I'm really happy and really pleased with and I think it captures the landscape really well. To have a solo exhibition, you've got something then you can show to another gallery, look, this gallery has been prepared to exhibit your work. There must be a reason why, and hopefully they like the work too. It's been lovely to see people's reactions and to hear their comments, and uh, thankfully they've been very favourable. And here we see this work on the walls today and we know that the artist has put in tremendous effort to produce something that for him has just taken him a little further down the road in the journey to creating art that says something to him but also says a great deal to other people. 
the Surrey Artist of the Year at the New Ashcake Gallery is really important for local tourism. It raises the profile of the area. There's some lovely paintings here actually of really iconic landmarks in Surrey, such as Leith Hill, the one I'm standing next to. It's a really good tourism offer. There's a lot of people that do like coming um, into the area and having a look at art galleries, museums and so on. And the, the New Ashgate Gallery is a little gem for people to come to, so we're very supportive of them. My wife and I have really enjoyed uh, going around with, with Stuart and looking at his work and uh, I've had to keep my hands firmly in my pocket uh, this evening because my wife keeps saying, oh, I like that one, I like that one. So, it's a privilege to come here to the new Ashgate Gallery. Uh, it's a very important part of Farnham where people uh, can uh, uh, display their, their works. And I've always enjoyed the variety of different sorts of art that you can see here in this gallery. And to have the uh, Surrey Artist of the Year displaying here today, I think, is, is terrific. What we're looking at, in addition to this kind of competition, is to, to be able to invest in emerging artists, to give the opportunity to learn how they can professionally develop and also run what for them is their own business, to keep them, in many cases, in our own communities.